Hello, brothers and sisters. This is Lisa, and I'm here to share a word given to Heidi Bryden. The title is Agree to Disagree, and this word was posted May 11th, 2023. Agree to disagree. There is power in disagreement. What you just went through is just a foretaste of what is coming, says the Spirit of the living God. I am fortifying you with my power and strength to make you a pillar, an oak of righteousness that will stand in times of testing. For the devil, your enemy, wishes to test you in the furnace of iniquity and adversity, but know that the testing of your faith produces perseverance, and perseverance must finish its work in you in order to make your standing firm with deep roots. Look to me and ask of me what my will is, and agree as one voice in one body what the Spirit is saying. Agree to disagree with the tactics of your adversary. He will try and restrict you, your voice, your freedom, your hope, your future, I say to you now, there is power when two or more of you come together and agree upon my word. Right now I am speaking to you and saying to disagree with all that sly fox is trying to distract you with. Where he calls for restrictions, I call freedom. Know that you have an assignment a specific job to do, and your adversary doesn't want you to finish the race. But come to me, for I am the living water that you need to drink for your thirsty, dry soul. I am the breath of life to breathe. Breathe in my clean spirit, and I will fill every fiber of your being with life and breath overflowing. Agree with me and come to the wellspring of life and life eternal. For when you turn from your wicked ways and from temptation, at that moment I will give you the grace to overcome. Step out from among those who pull you away from me and agree with my words, says the Lord. I am the breath of life, and he who seeks me will find me. Those who hide in me shall be protected from all that is and is to come. I have overcome the world, and now so have you, says the Lord. The thief does not come except to steal and to kill and to destroy. I have come, that they may have life, and that they may have it more abundantly. John 10.10 blessings. And that is the end of this message. I pray you all have a beautiful day in the Lord. God bless each and every one of you, and I will see you either next video or in the air. Bye-bye.